Hi guys, in this video I'm gonna show you over voltage problem on Ford Explorer. Here I'll show you, we start the engine and we see system voltage levels regions on my computer that connected to OBD2 port. We see growing voltage, here is 15 volts, 15.1. Consequently, voltage pointer is higher than should be, and it shakes. Then, when we turn on our headlights, we see tremor. Light blinks, we see it on the wall. On the lamps and onto the gauge cluster. You see, 15 and 2 already. I prepared tools for diagnostics and solving this problem. And we proceed. Guys, alas, I must disappoint you, but I'm glad. Because everything was surprisingly easier than appeared. That thing appeared horribly obvious. It was all because of this little fucker. Problem I was suffering two years. I don't know what they make these Chinese fuses out of. But fact is, it was all because of it. See, here it was. Now I put 20 ampere fuse here. Just found random fuse in my glove box. And what we have now? We have this, we have 14.5 volts. I wasn't this happy with my car for a long time. Look, arrow stands still in the middle and no shaking. Turn the lights on, nothing blinks. 14.6 and it was... Look, the light, no blinking. Smooth luminance. Even these bulbs on my roof, it blinked before. And no more. What was this? I don't understand this shit of Chinese maybe has bad conductivity. Maybe bad contact, maybe it was oxidized. But now I put original fuse. Let me show it to you again. Here it is. It has 20 ampere labeling. On Chinese there's no marking. And 40 points. 6, 14.6 or 7 max, which is good voltage. Nothing blinks or shimmers. Gauge readings is good. Step on gas, it stands still. Voltage is on nominal value. So a problem I was suffering two years was in this basic thing. Never use Chinese fuses. Press thumbs up and subscribe. See ya!